There are two pre-requirements for this video. One is bootloader unlock. And the other is jailbreak. You can refer to our guides on these subjects to get your device prepped up. Now, first things first, let's clear out what are system apps. System apps play an important role in an operating system, these applications provide basic to advanced features to the end user and are typically not uninstallable due to their importance. But in this video, we will show you how to uninstall system applications in Windows Phone 8.1 and also how to get the latest versions installed in your phone. But why you need to uninstall? The answer entirely depends on user preference. After the store shutdown, system apps which were updated via the store were no longer updatable. As a result, some phones can stuck with really old system app versions which lacks both new features and bug fixes. So, if you want to have the latest system apps installed in your device, then this is the guide you need. In order to make this guide clear, I will divide system apps to two types. One is the usual system applications which can be found and launched in apps list. The other is settings extra system apps, these can be found and launched in settings app and are exclusive to Lumia lineup. I will showcase uninstalling these two types separately. So, that's all you need to know, let's dig into uninstalling system applications in Windows Phone 8.1. But before we get on with it, go through all these notes and double check that you are ready. First, for the sake of demonstration, I will quickly show that you can't uninstall system applications by usual means, skip if necessary. Now that it's taken care of, let's begin. Open Windows Phone Internals application in your PC. If you don't have it, links are in the description but given that this guide requires bootloader unlock, you should already have it. Go to Manual Mode. There, click on Switch to Mass Storage Mode. Then your device will reboot out of Windows Phone OS. It will take approximately two reboots for the device to get into Mass Storage Mode. Once it's done, your PC will recognize a new drive named Main OS as shown here, the driver letter depends on the partition layout of your device. Go open the Main OS drive in your file explorer. The folder we need here is the programs folder, but it's locked for security concerns. You will need to gain ownership to access this folder, do as shown here. Same deal here, you need to get ownership of the common files folder as well. Once you are in, scroll to the bottom and then open the folder named Zaps. This folder contains the installation files of the system apps which gets installed during the out-of-box experience when setting up the device for the first time or after a hard reset. What we are going to do is delete the installation packages of the system apps we like to uninstall. If you are not able to identify which system apps these packages represent, use an archive manager to preview the file contents to identify them. As an example, here I will delete the Bing applications and also the Xbox Video and Xbox Music System apps as well. Maybe the WeChat app too though it's not a system app, you can delete them as well such as carrier apps and such. Make sure to delete both the installation package and the XML file of the same app as well. Once you are done, close the file explorer. Boot your device out of mass storage mode, simply do a soft reset to get out of mass storage mode.
Then, close Windows Phone internals. Back in your phone, go to Settings. And then to About. There, click Reset your phone button. Before doing that, make sure you back up all your data from the device such as apps, files and everything you need. Factory Reset will delete everything from the device which is what we are going to do. Once you are ready, proceed with it. Your device will reboot and the rotating cogs will take place with a progress bar. This might take some time depending on the device model and state of the hardware but usually this will only take around 15 to 30 minutes. Once it's finished, you will be presented with the out-of-box experience when the device boots back. Complete the setup as usual. This is the stage where our work comes into effect. Since we uninstalled the installation packages of the system apps we need, those apps will not be installed now. Wait till it's over. Alright, we are in. Now none of the Bing apps are present. And Xbox Video Xbox Music System apps are also not present, as well as the WeChat app too. So, everything that was deleted is not installed now. Now, you can install the latest versions of the system apps back into the device. Please refer to these notes before proceeding ahead. Settings Extras System Apps are a set of Lumia exclusive system apps tied to the device settings that controls Lumia exclusive features in a device. Every settings entry below the about is a separate settings extras app here. These apps were also updated by Windows Store so hereby we will show you how to uninstall these and also how to install the latest versions of these back into your device. We will show a really easy yet tricky method to uninstall these apps. Go to date plus time settings. there, change the year to 2106 and the month to March. Save it and go try opening any settings extras apps. Each of them will tell you there is a problem with the app and will let you uninstall them by merely pressing a button. Do the same for every settings extras app you need to uninstall. You will be able to uninstall all of them except the Network Plus app. If you wish to uninstall that as well, you will need to follow the previous method of uninstalling system apps. Once you got all of them uninstalled, you can then reinstall the latest versions back. Just remember to set the date back to the present values else your apps will not function correctly. That's all for this guide, hope to continue releasing the video versions for the official guide series. Goodbye!